Hello everyone, welcome to a foreigner farming in the Philippines. Well, there they are. There's 34 in there. And this little guy here might come out of it. <laughs> I don't think there's anybody uh, left in there that's going to hatch and be viable. Uh, we lost 10 um, after they had hatched. Uh, they're, they're really crowded in this right now. So last night I had put 10 in, back into the main incubator. And early this morning, Tata yeah, thought they were just hatched. And so he put them back in here and they were just too crowded. So uh, they smothered each other. So uh, the numbers would have been, uh, well, actually it was 11. So uh, 46. So this was a really good hatch. And even with this 35 here, it's better than what we've been doing. So 46, it was almost a 50% hatch rate this time. And so I think for the age of the eggs that we had, uh, that's pretty good. So I think I've solved the, the low hatch rate, the really low hatch rate problem uh, by bringing the temperature up in the incubator, by having it at the correct temperature. Come on, little guy. He just got too hot. And being as I had taken him out with the ones that I thought were dead, and then I saw him breathing, uh, he's doing pretty well. This little guy here, too. Wake up there, little buddy. You know, Tata, let's leave these, uh, no, go ahead. These two, this one, and this one, let's leave in here. And we'll put this guy in here, too. Because the just, the just hatch ones, I want to uh, let them dry off a little bit. Please don't leave that one, Tata. He's very weak. A couple hours and we'll move them back over. Mm -hmm. Alright. Come on guys, we're going to let you get dried off in the incubator. And then in a couple hours, I'll move these over with the others. Oh, you're very mad now. There's one left in there that may hatch and may not. And of course, I'm going to leave the incubator on for another day. Uh, but usually ones that, that, that hatch a day late or more, uh, they just don't make it. Because also, uh, the ones that are hatched late are, are smaller. And they just don't, everybody else starts to pick on them. It's just, it's never good, so. We'll just set that just like that. I'm not even going to turn it on. I'll just let those few in there dry in peace. One more little guy right there that might hatch. But I don't see any of the others pit. Uh, they may and they may not. So I'll leave this going for one more day. And uh, see what happens. I just accidentally unplugged it. All right, so we got uh, 46. Pretty happy with that. So it makes it worthwhile to use an incubator. When I was uh, when I was doing it, and only getting 20 or 25 to hatch. Uh, sometimes, you know, I think one time even less than 20. When I was only getting that many, it was just a, you know, it was a waste of eggs. And I'd put almost 100 eggs in the incubator and only get 20 to hatch. Uh, it was pretty much just trading money. I was wasting 100 eggs at uh, 5 pesos each and getting 20 chickens, which I could buy for 46, so it just wasn't a great turnout. But with 46, it's a good deal. So thank you everyone. That's the chicks.
Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.